Um, hi guys, I just wanted to talk about um, the once saved, always saved theory, which is completely wrong. Um, this is an urgent message to all Christians, because I'm seeing a lot of Christians that, I'm not being judgmental or anything, I'm just saying what I've been seeing, a lot of Christians that go to church on Sunday, they're faithful on Sunday, but rest of the day they're, they're drinking, partying, giving into sin, just that's just because you're you were saved that doesn't mean once saved is always saved it doesn't work like that if you you got to repent you got to once you're saved you need to basically start living for Christ now yes you had fun in your you had fun before while you were sinning but now you got to forget about it don't let the demons the devil and his demons tempt you into doing anything rebuke them in the name of Jesus Christ that's the only you can only go to th go to heaven through Jesus Christ so yeah, I'm seeing because a lot of pastors are teaching that now. Once saved, always saved. That's completely wrong. You can verify this with the Lord if if you don't believe me. Um, yeah, if just because you're going to church on Sundays while you're partying the rest of the week, that doesn't mean you're saved. You're nowhere near close to being saved. So you just got to repent. Forget about your old sinful lifestyle if you're living for Jesus now. Forget about the drinking. Forget about the partying. Just just make every... Put at least some part of your day. Make it about Jesus. Okay? So once saved, always saved. Don't believe that. That's complete bogus. It doesn't work like that. Even if you're saved and, if, and, you, and you willingly transgress and fall back into sin, you will not inherit God, God's kingdom. So yeah, that's what I just wanted to share with you guys. Um, that's pretty much it.